You probably clicked on this video because you're wondering what is the most hated playstyle in Warzone? Is it stacking? Is it campers? But it's none of those. The most hated playstyle in this game is clearly movement and it's been that way for a while. In this video, I go on an in-depth deep dive into the movement community. I interview movement players, snipers, nice. world record holders, And much more. Who is a mo Wait, whoa, 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 whoa. Oh my god. Also, I have a surprise for you guys. So, to make this video even better, I've decided to get in character, to get in operator. I have decided I am going to be a monster energy skin. Now, as you can see, I'm in a very lore accurate monster energy fit. Everything's the same, no differences. Honestly, this is cosplaying at its greatest. I felt like, you know, I'm only doing it justice. I feel like, you know, you guys deserve the best. So let me introduce you guys to all the people I'm interviewing. Okay, so who am I here with? Introduce yourself. Hello, I'm Figo. I'm a COG content creator and streamer, and uh, I dropped the world record, you probably remember, on Rebirth Island. I'm Julia, IDK Julia. I stream full-time on Twitch. I do S&D. I'm a sniper. Rev Warzone. <laughs> Rev Warzone? Off to a Should banger start. How do you feel about movement players? Um, I'm kind of indifferent about them. Like, they're cool. I like watching them, like, on Warzone, but when it's, like, hubs players kind of, like, doing... Like the most, it's kind of cringe. Movement players, I do not hate them. Uh, I don't think it's a bad thing, but they definitely get on my nerves with all the tweets and sometimes the necessary, I'm just like, I cannot watch this. One thing I am gonna say though, is movement players are definitely holding them back in the content space because a lot of high content creators, most of their viewership is is casual players and casual players do not like the movement thing one thing i'm gonna say is that pisses me off is the unlock tools not that you're unlock tooling i don't care if you do it do it but you're gonna get banned and don't bitch that you're gonna get banned and that call of duty is terrible because you're unlock tooling i think it's good i think it like adds a skill gap it doesn't make the game i don't know what the fuck to say i don't want to do this bro what the fuck is happening We're, that, <laughs> your opinion rev what is the cringiest type of movement I think like the super extra like YY macro fast macro like spinning in circles like very quick shaking your screen like I think that shit's cringe. Uh, it's more so like the ego. I don't know. I feel like them doing the most and then you know getting one kill or two kills and it's like it's just it's like a they need an ego boost most of the time. 1080s randomly the YY macro shaking their screen. Do you think that most movement players are cheating? And if you were to say a split, maybe 50, 50, 60, 40, whatever the split may be, how many of them do you think are actually cheating? I do not think most movement players are cheating. There was that one Twitter group, Star Exclusive, that was blatantly cheating and posting. Those are the only like people I've seen that are cheating movement wise. But honestly, closeted, I would say like 5%, maybe even less. Like, I feel like if there were more people cheating, we would know because it would be obvious. You can tell. Like, I do think like some of them are um, like it's it's kind of been like proven that some people are. They just kind of try to hide it with whatever the fuck they're doing. Uh... I don't think every like movement person cheats, but there is some out there. And then the final question is, do you think that movement is ruining Call of Duty or taking Call of Duty in a uh, bad direction? That's another thing I'm kind of indifferent about. Like it's it's just your playstyle. If like that's what you you want to do, you know, it's what you want to do. But like I feel like giving some sort of sense of like movement or whatever kind of makes the game fun. Definitely not. I think that's like, that's what makes Call of Duty fun. I don't say the movement comes ruining the game. If it tripled in size, I think, I think it would be, I wouldn't be on Twitter anymore. And just so you know that this is coming from a valid place, I had former FaZe member and Nuke Squad member Santana react to me live on stream two nights ago. Here's what he had to say about my movement. Gage the demon. Here we go. Chat. My boy Gage, who is a mo- Wait, whoa, 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 whoa. Did we miss that? Did we just miss that? Oh my god! I heard he's nasty with the throwing knives, brother! We got streamer clips in here! Yeah, yeah, yeah. Broke it, broke it, bitch. No, oh, Wait, he doesn't live he doesn't live right here, right? This is like this is like two different teams. Oh god. Guys, what is going on? What the actual fuck was that throwing knife? Scoop! Scoop the whoop! Holy fuck, same game! Same game! Same game! Behind you, dickhead. <laughs> oh, brother! No plates! What you gonna do, Gage? What you gonna do? What you gonna do, Gage? 
This guy doesn't even know what fucking game he's playing. There's just no way you did that. You're an asshole. That's, that's... That's a yellow card. That's a yellow card. You're an asshole. <laughs> Yo. Oh, okay. Alright. 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 That was a fucking red card. That was a red card. Unnecessary sportsmanlike conduct foul flag. Red card. W vid, Gage. W fucking vid. Feel like I've seen what I need to see, Gage. So movement, I'm gonna give you a 10 out of 10. So for the rest of this video, I just wanted to talk to you guys, kind of give you my opinions on movement. Give or take, I kind of agree with what everyone was saying, or at least parts of everything everyone was saying. I do think that movement needs to be here to play the game. I don't think COD would be fun without it anymore. I think it does need the, the movement tech to survive in today's video games. But there is starting to become a stigma around movement players. It's definitely being considered more cringe. Us movement players are definitely being considered cheaters, even when we're definitely not cheating. And it, it is becoming a problem. I mean, you have you have these accounts like Bad Boy Beeman, Call of Shame, that are exposing people for cheating, and usually they're getting it wrong. And then it just makes all of us look like cheaters, and it all makes us look bad when literally we're just playing the game, having fun. But honestly, this is just the sad direction that video games are going. And honestly, the reason I've changed my content to this style away from the clip videos, because nobody cares that you're good at video games anymore. And I would like to really hone in on this part. People do not care if you're good at video games anymore. Being good at a video game is seen as cringe now. If you're good at video games, you're playing a bot lobby. If you're good at video games, you need to touch grass. If you're playing a video game, you've never felt a woman's touch. Like these are constantly things people say, because you're no longer looking up to the players that are really good. Because now everyone wants to be that content creator. Everybody wants to be that best player. I saw a study the other day that 50% of my generation wants to be content creators. That's fucking ridiculous. It honestly just sucks for a lot of us that actually took the time, spent hours in shipment shooting bots just to get better at COD, just for everything we've ever done to be downplayed, just because VPNs exist and we press our Y button fast. I mean, it's ridiculous if you really think about it. And I don't think it's bringing it down in any way, but I do think that the movement comm is spiraling downward and I really don't know what could save it. I just don't, I just think it's slowly becoming something that's oversaturated and something people are not interested in already, which is unfortunate because I really like the way the playstyle looks. I like playing like that, but it seems to be something that's dying rapidly fast. And, and it sucks because you even have famous streamers who are constantly bagging on the Y wires. But they're all pressing Y, and they're all moving just like we've been since Rebirth. I know that some people are going to agree with me. I know that some aren't. I know some are probably going to say that they found it cringy from the beginning. But genuinely, I just miss the old days of COD. Not the movement mechanics, not the games itself, just the community. I just remember watching players when I was a kid, genuinely thinking, I want to be just as good as them. And in anything, sports, whatever it is, I've always idolized people that are good at things, and I've always wanted to get better myself i think it's a really loser mindset we have now that everyone is cheating nobody can do this without cheating because you can it's really not that hard call of duty is the easiest game to get good at if you're taking it serious i promise you it's the easiest game to get good at it's not hard i think you could become a high level yy movement sweat in less than two months if you played at least two hours a day Either way, I want to close this out, giving you something to think about. I want you guys to go in the comment section and let me know your thoughts on movement. I want to know if you think it's a cringy playstyle. And also, if you could leave a like and subscribe. Thank you guys for all the crazy support. My video from like three days ago has like 28k, almost 30k, which is fucking nuts to me. And I just want to, and I just want to say I love you guys. I hope you all have a good rest of your day. Nice. That's one. That's two. You gotta switch guns. BP 50 conversion kit. That's three. Where's the last one? I'm not even gonna play it up. I'm just gonna stim. I'm just gonna stim and, sk stim and skate on you. I'm gonna stim and skate on you. Uh huh. Oh my gosh. Oh my god. Oh my god. No shot. No fucking shot. These guys are getting shit on like this.
That guy has no clue what's going on. Where y'all at? Downstairs? I'm coming for you. RPG to the face? I'll eat it. I don't care. Downstairs again? Let me just slide up on you real quick. And then slide on your sister. Hello. See ya.